Several local businesses are giving back this Small Business Saturday. They're coming together in one place to raise money for the family of a victim of a fatal accident. Our Matt Restino has more on their act of kindness. By sharing what happened to Gabriella Lowell, a Worcester business is trying to create something positive from a tragedy. Gabriella was killed by a distracted driver in June of 2018. Hot Power Yoga Center owner Kristen Marengo knew Gabriella and wants others to know her story. Gabriella was such a shining light, such a beautiful girl. Her mother is the most selfless, most amazing woman on the planet. So I'm friends with her. I've known her since I was young. And I said, you know what, let's, let's, have, let's get together and spread mindfulness so that this doesn't happen to anybody else. Thirteen local small businesses are coming together to raise money in Gabriella's memory this weekend. It's all a part of Small Business Saturday. We're all going to open up the yoga studio and turn into like a little mini mall where all clients and anyone, it's open to the public, can come in and shop small, promoting Small Business Saturday. The center will be raffling off prizes donated by local businesses. 100% of the proceeds will go to their Random Acts of Kindness Fund, which is used to buy toys and gifts for people in need during the holidays. Marengo says giving back is a central part of her studio's mission. A big part of yoga is uniting with others, helping others, spreading compassion, doing nice things, um, helping people you know that are less fortunate, just spreading joy, spreading love, and you know, coming together as a community. Each gift will come with a slip of paper sharing Gabriella's story and asking the recipient to perform a small act of kindness of their own. Not only to spread Gabriella's story so that people are more cautious when they're in the car and behind the wheel, but also to spread a big ripple effect of doing random acts around the city. The event will take place this Saturday from 5 to 7 p.m. There will be food and drinks, and Making Worcester Warm will be outside selling Christmas wreaths. In the studio, Matt Restino, Worcester News Tonight.